Hi and welcome to another video of SpaceX update. JSX Air, which is an independent air carrier in the United States, is set to become the first air carrier to provide in-flight Starlink Wi-Fi services. The company announced that its passengers will enjoy Starlink Wi-Fi for free later this year onward. SpaceX and JSX have signed a deal to initially install Starlink on 100 of its air jets. It is a big step towards the adoption of Starlink on airplanes. The primary goal of Starlink is to provide high-speed low-latency internet to remote places on Earth and also on moving transport like cars, airplanes even ships for seamless experience of broadband internet. And lift off of Starlink 4. Yesterday, SpaceX had launched another batch of 53 Starlink satellites into space, making it the 15th launch of the year for the company. The first stage booster which supported this mission landed for a record 12th time. You can see this booster has touched down once again. This is the 12th recovery for this particular booster. The next launch for SpaceX is NASA's Crew-4 mission to the ISS on April 26, after several days of delay due to the delayed return of AX-1 crew. On Starbase, work still continue on Booster 7 inside the high bay. Contractors working on the completion of Wide Bay and we can see rapid progress on construction of the new Star Factory. Just to remind you, the FAA's announcement of the final programmatic environmental assessment for Starship Orbital Test Flight is just a week away. In a recent interview with TED, Elon said the first Starship Orbital Test Flight is a few months away pending regulatory approval. It's looking promising for us to have an orbital launch attempt uh, in, in a few months. Um, so uh, we're actually integrating the, uh, we'll be integrating the engines uh, into the booster for the first orbital flight uh, starting in about a week or two. The Starship is the only Mars-bound rocket in development in the entire world. I don't know why the FAA would put any restrictions on it, considering the scale of achievement that would bring to humanity as a whole. People seem to forget that SpaceX is working for the whole of mankind, not just for Elon Musk himself. It will ultimately put humans on the surface of another planet called Mars and humans will become a multi-planet species. Speaking of Mars, earlier this month, NASA's Perseverance rover captured a stunning video of Mars' potato-shaped moon, Phobos transiting across the surface of the Sun. We call it Martian solar eclipse. The detail and color of this footage are mind-blowing, and it was captured using a powerful high-definition camera, Mast Cam Z. That's it for now. If you like the content of this channel, please consider subscribing so that you don't miss any SpaceX-related news in the future. See you next time.